If you have everybody, welcome back to Team Dark Edition. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. Subscribe to Team Dark Magician. Let's do this. We're gonna do some doing some combos. So one, okay. So our first hand starting out is this. Y'all wondering, can we play with this hand? We can. It's a 45 card deck, but we can actually play. We're gonna activate this, pay half our life points to so we be at 4K. To add a, mm, uh, yeah, a zero attack monster. So basically, we're gonna add Kepler to deck the hand. Then we activate Kepler, effect the search. As long as we don't get Ash or anything, we should be good. And then we have like literally, let me show you. This is the best combo for DDs for 2024. Okay, it does play into Niv, but more likely, I have not seen Niv come against me with. Well, against my DD deck so far. I haven't had seen Nib. When I go to the tournament, no Nib. So I think, and then we activate Gate as long as it doesn't get Ash. Like I've seen Ash, but barely often. So we're gonna activate Gate. Usually we have a call by in hand, but we don't. Cause we run one call by, but sometimes we'll see it. So it's right there. Then we're gonna add Griffin. You always add the combo piece Griffin. So you can go full combo here. You'll see in the combos here. And then you'll see at the end how crazy this is. You activate Griffin, effect. Uh, effect this special summon himself, cause he's the best card in the deck, you'll see. Link two. Link two. Then we're gonna activate Tell effect. No, no, I mean, go match effect. To pay a thousand life points to set the plan. Usually this goes through. Okay, you'll see why I'm doing this, you'll see. You'll see it here in one second. Okay, you wonder why I can't pendulum with someone, I can't. But, we can activate Ophros' effect in the scale. We're gonna act effect, pop this, and then pop him, send the extra deck. And then, since we have this in hand, we're gonna set the scale. Now we can pendulum with someone. Pendulum summon. Activate Griffin's effect. Should we? Kind of difficult to play right now, guys, because I don't know if we should act. Yeah, we'll activate this card. Draw one, hopefully get some good. Yeah, we did. Next, we're going, but we need a monster hand to do that. So we're gonna, right, right now we're foolish. We're gonna foolish Necrosign. He'll stay in the combos. This is why this is the best combo for DDs for 24. And then you'll see this next play is we're gonna XC Soken. So we're gonna XC Soken into Wave High King Caesar. Cause this is the best combo. And then we rank up XCs as long as they don't have Nib or anything. So we rank up Cs. Then we use one overlay unit for Wave King's Tell to lose a thousand attack on him and the opponent takes a thousand damage. As long as they didn't play around, as long as we didn't activate a uh, Dark Ruler. So link to into Golgamash and then tell effect to foolish. Or now we're gonna foolish Vice Typhoon. This is why it's the best combo for 2024, you'll see. We can just do it for those two cards we need to add off of it. It's crazy if we just have Gate in hand and Ash Gate, we're still going full combo. No, Ash Kepler. So if we have Gate in hand, oh, full combo. Like, that's the best plays, yeah, like literally. And then we're gonna activate, mm, since it was on summon, we could revive, yes. no, not yet. We're gonna necro sign. Yeah, we'll revive, I'll just show you. We're gonna ride Griffin. Griffin's effect on revive, cause tell chain link one, chain link two would be the revive. So, uh, no, chain link one would be the full show. My battle show is, it doesn't matter. You know the combos. All right, we will add the best card in, mostly in this deck. One of, actually, this is the second, like the two best cards. Is DD Headhunt is one of the best card in this deck, one of the best. Literally, it just, it's a snatch deal, it's insane. All right, and then we activate, we're gonna banish with Necro. So we can still fuse into Flanking Gang, as you'll see here. We're gonna fuse with these two. Banish those away. 
in the Flame Hiking Genghis. And you'll see this next play. We're going to banish Tell since we foolish with him already. We don't need it no more. The fusion summon in the flame high king genius. Then we can activate flame king genius effect to revive Caesar. Then we can activate flame high king genius to revive Orphros. Double the Orphros. Okay, we already we're at six chairs since we took 2000 so far. But look at this. We link two with these two right away. The last link we have, this is why you run three Golden Ash. This is the reason. You link, then you add the one of the other good cards in this deck is Swamp King. And it's Swamp King, as long as it doesn't go ghost over again. I've never had a guard ghost over again, but a gate had that, but Swamp King effect. We're gonna banish these two. The fusion summon in the flanking Genghis. Now we're literally, this is like the best combo. Watch, watch this. We're gonna have Sea Soken into Wave Hiking Caesar. And this is the best combo because look, you went full combo with those cards. And then we go into Sync. Oh, you know what we're sinking into? Zikri. Another really good card. Spell Negate or Trap. Spell and Trap Negate. Face up. Then, you know what's crazy? Literally, we had full combo. We rank up. On the flame hiking Genghis. In the fences, in case you have lightning storm. Next play is the last one. Is we set DD Headhunt to the field. Then we pass turn. We got Spelling Gate. We got a pop on Dark Contract. Detach. Then we got another Detach. Then we have two Spelling Gates. Uh, no, two Unter Special Summons and Gates, as long as it's not a Heron Summon. But this card's crazy. It's not once per turn. And we also, if this gets destroyed by Battle of Artifact, boom. When it gets to Graveyard, we can special summon the DD monster from Extra Deck or Grave. And this is my combo, guys. It's the best combo for 2024 of August. Like, literally. The 16th, the best. You'll never find a better combo like this for DDs. Full combo with DD head on. Sometimes they'll have Turn of Darkness or Pride of Lessons, but this is insane. In the last two cards I had in hand, Follow up. Let me see what our next play is. Oh, we drew right the next time we draw into turn dog. Even if they have some other plays, they have turn dogs on the next play if we can't beat them this turn. But more likely, we're going to beat them this turn. But if you like this video, I hope you hit the subscribe button, hit that like button, hit the notification bell, and subscribe to Team Dark Magicians. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.